Hi guys, when you upgrade from Win 8 or 8.1 on a Win 10, that's not stable, and you want to go back to Win 8 or 8.1. Next, we'll show you how to drop 10 to Win 8 or 8.1. When you want to download Windows 8 or 8.1 from Windows 10 without the Windows.old folder in the C drive, or it's been more than 10 days since the upgrade, Today I'm going to show you how to drop Windows 10 to Windows 8 or 8.1. You open the web browser, then type from the Windows 8.1 ISO and press enter to search. Click on the Microsoft Windows 8.1 ISO file download page. Here you drag down, select edition, and select Windows 8.1. Then select confirm, then the language you choose. English and then select confirm there will be two versions 32 bit and 64 bit to see how many bits you are installing you open the folder right click on this PC and select properties here the system type will tell you how many bits your machine is installing if the system type is an x64 based processor you download the 64-bit version, and for x86-based processors, you download the 32-bit version. My x64 will load the 64-bit version. You click on download to download. Wait for the download to be fast or slow, depending on the network speed. After the download, it will be in the download folder. You need to switch to another drive because the download folder is on the C drive. We will pass through the E drive. After the transfer, you need to uncompress the ISO file into a new folder using the decompression software. If you have not installed the decompression software, you can see how to install it and use yourself to link to the description. You're waiting to uncompress. Next. You click on the Windows icon, select Settings, then select Update and Security, then Recovery, select Restart Now of the Advanced Startup, and wait for the Run and Update. When you go to the Setup Selection mode, you select Troubleshoot, then select Advanced Options. In the Advanced option, you select Command Prompt. The machine will restart and go to command prompt mode. You click on the name of your computer, if you have a password, you enter it, then select Cody None. The machine does not set a password, so we will choose Cody None too. It will appear a window for me to type the command. You type from notepad and press enter to be able to find and open the installation file. The notepad window appears. You click on the file, select open, and in the file of type, you select all files. Then click on this PC. Select the drive that saved the original Win 8.1 setup folder and open the folder. Then you select setup and right click on select run as administrator, it will appear to install Win 8.1 just like you installed with USB, you leave the default, and then you select next. Select install now, and it proceeds to the installation process. Select accept Windows terms, and then select next. Here you select custom install Windows only, this time you will select the drive to install Win, you choose the C drive to set up, if you do not remember which drive, you can check again by pressing the Shift plus F10 key combination to open the CMD window up, then type from the notepad, Select the file item, then open, select this PC. Here's to tell you your drives, your C drives have 111 GB of free 81.3 GB. You go back to the setup screen, see which drive has the same capacity, and choose partition 3 because of the same volume, and then choose next. There's a message that says your old files will be in the window. Old folder but you can't go back to the old version. After the installation you want to delete, you can see the deletion in the description link. You chose OK. The installation process will begin. 
you wait for the machine to install for about 15 to 20 minutes. After the installation, go to the setup process for your computer, name your computer, and select next. Custom. The network connection you choose yes, you leave the default and then choose next. Next, continue selecting next. Here you have a Microsoft account, then log in. If you don't have one, you can create one by clicking on create a new account. If you enter the wrong account, the machine will transfer you through create. Local account. You click on create a local account, and you specify the name for the account and password to log in. Note to remember the password to sign in, if you do not want to set the password, skip it. Then select the finish. Wait for the setup to be completed. After about Win 8.1, you need to go to Windows Update to update Windows. So I've taught you how to drop Windows 10 to Windows 8 or 8.1. If you see or like it, share it, and subscribe to the channel to see more videos. Hello, and see you again.